the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. Before I proceed with the main topic of this video, let me first answer the question when will this fight pass end? I think the fight pass will end uh, one or two months from now. So if you're asking, can I still finish the fight pass? Yes, you can. Next, Gamer Nomi said it's free. Where is the champion? They said it's free. Guys, you really need to work for it, but you don't need to spend anything. You don't need to buy the 40k car shards to get Ochaku, but you need to do daily quests. So if you reach tier 50, you will unlock all the rewards on the left side of the fight pass here. The Chikara, the Yen, etc. And if you reach tier 50, you will get Ochaku. So Gamer Nom, should I buy the fight pass? Yes, you need to buy the fight pass. Why? I can unlock Ochaku without even buying that. Guys, check this out. The rewards. If you finish the fight pass tier 1 to 50 and you bought the fight pass for 40k, you will get more than 40k Chikara shards. Check this out. Tier 46, 15k. Tier 41, 12.5k. Tier 37, 10k. On the left side, you will get 5k. 34, 10k. See that, guys? You will get more than 40k in return. I think it's almost uh, 70 to 90k. It's just that you just need to pay 40k to get back Quirks, Specials, Yens, more Chikara Shards, and Champions. All you need to do is play. Which is why we're, we're here. We want to play the game, right? Okay, so buy the Fight Pass and get everything that you spent on it. Okay, now, time for the main topic of the video. So for Tier 50, the final champion that you will unlock is Ochaku. Let's check the benefits, 60 Chakra, 40 Strength, and 40 Dura. Guys, not bad. And check the design. Not actually not bad. This really looks like Ochaku from My Hero Academia. If we're gonna rate it, 9 out of 10. For me, that's 9 out of 10. Next, we're gonna check the damage and the defense. And the glitch. Yeah, there's another glitch <laughs> I'm gonna show you later. Okay, so now okay, my favorite stance, the L stance. Who has this stance? So good, guys. <laughs> okay, now for the damage, it will increase your damage by forty percent if you're not using a quirk. But if you're using a quirk, it's uh sixty-five percent. Okay, normal punch is hundred four n. So if you like uh equip or summon this champion, plus forty percent, right? So 140 plus, there you go. It's working. Why am I showing you this? Because some champions uh, has a problem with their stats and they're not working. Again, this has 3.6 DE damage. Guys, why did I use this power? Because this is not a quirk. I want to show you the difference if you're using a quirk. Now let's try champion. There you go. Five, yeah, it's correct. 40 percent. With 3.5 something plus 40 percent of it. Yeah, it's 5, so it's correct. Next up, we're gonna use a quirk. Again, for the quirk, your damage should increase by 65%. A while ago, the Tailed Beast Bomb increases damage, but not as high as 65%, right? So we have Hell Flame Quirk here. 2.5 DE. If we use Ochako, 70%, it should have been almost 5. So 4.67, something like 4.7 DE should be your damage okay there you go 4.60 correct so Ochaku's damage buff is working okay. next up let's check the defense but before that again let's uh, confirm if the damage is working in tournament dimension this will be fast don't worry so we have the quirk 15 for the tail beast bomb for the quirk let's use the first skill again damage is 35 15 and 35 so for the tail beast bomb it should be after uh, like equipping Ochaku 40% oh, 20 20 plus right is that correct yeah 20 plus 
Yeah, 20 plus. Let's go. 21. Okay, good job. Next up, 35 damage. Should be 40, 50 something, right? 50 plus. <laughs> Hope I'm correct. I'm just estimating, guys. Damage should be 65%. Increase. Let's go. Oh, 65. That's higher. <laughs> My bad. But still, it's working. Now, to show you the glitch part, check the de the defense buff, guys. You will be shocked by this. Okay. Baseline again. My favorite. Sunfist, 50 damage. Slash, 10 damage, right? For Ochaku's defense buff, if your enemy is using uh, other skills, not a perk, your defense will increase by 25%. But if your enemy is using a perk, your defense will increase by 50%, okay? Now, let's check. We're going to use skills and powers that are not quirk. Did you see that 13 from 50 to 13? That's like 75% increased defense. Again, that's the, bu uh, the bug or the glitch. Normal sword attack. Then, it became 3. So, that's 70% damage. I mean, 70% defense buff. That's the problem with that. We are expecting 25 to 50% defense buff. We're not even using a quirk, but the defense is so high now. Let's try the belly laser. 2 damage. Did you see that? The defense is so high if your enemy is using the quirk. What if we even use explosive nova, right? That will that transformation will increase your defense. Let's check it out. Again, this is the glitch or the bug again. The defense is so high. You want to use this in the tournament dimension? Go for it. We have 80% now. So the 50 damage is became 7. The slash 2. Right? Oh, the belly laser. 1 damage. You see that bug? That's the, that the defense is so high. I think the developers will fix this. It's the same as Miho. When before getting nerfed. Okay, so I think that will be it. Guys, I've used the Hellflame quirk, right? But if you want to maximize the damage of Ochaku, you can use other quirks such as the Zero Gravity quirk. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that quirk is the best quirk for boss fights. Want me to prove it to you? I'm going to show you a short clip of that. Fighting Kurama using this champion, Explosive Nova, and the Exit skill of Zero Gravity Quirk. And that will be it for this video. Guys, I hope that you learned something from this video. I will make a compilation of all the glitches, bugs from this fight pass. Watch out for that. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out!